Foreigner alert, you might be eligible for a 20% off your purchase price of a property here in Singapore. Hi everyone, my name is Casey from Home Quarters and at Home Quarters, we specialize in customized marketing strategy to properly expose your unit for sale. In this episode, we'll find out actually how foreigners are able to save up to 20% off of their property purchase price here in Singapore. So let's go. So what is this 20% off that I am talking about? Is it a great Singapore sales and Singapore is actually giving a great discount for all the property purchases for foreigners? Not so. In this case, I'm actually talking about the 20% off, which is the additional buyer stamp duty that typical foreigner need to foot above the purchase price of the property. However, five countries around the world are able to enjoy a remission for this additional buyer stamp duty. And they are enjoying the same treatment as that of Singaporean when they purchase a property in Singapore. Let's list down what are the different countries that are under the respective free trade agreement, they are able to enjoy such treatment. For national and permanent residents of Iceland, Liechtenstein, Norway and Switzerland, be it you are a national, meaning citizen of the country or permanent residents, you are eligible to be treated the same in terms of stamp duty payment as a Singaporean. Right, secondly, if you are a national of the United States of America, meaning you are a citizen of the United States of America, then you are also eligible to be treated the same way as Singaporean when you are purchasing a property here. So why is this so? This is because free trade agreements. From the Ministry of Trade and Industry Singapore website, we quote, Singapore has an open economy which is driven by trade in goods and services. And Free trade agreement, FTAs, are treaties which make trade and investment between two or more economies easier. Also, with FTAs, Singapore-based exporter and investor stand to enjoy a myriad of benefits such as tariff concession, preferential access to certain sector, faster entry into markets and intellectual property protection. So, the reverse is also true for investors who are investing in Singapore as well. As Singapore is a trade-dependent nation, the government have signed free trade agreements with the government of other nations to allow for mutual benefits between the country in terms of trade. Right, this enables preferred treatment for citizens and also permanent residents for these few countries. With this exclusion, citizens and permanent residents of these few countries are eligible to be treated the same as all Singaporeans for properties that they do acquire. For the first property, they do not have to pay any sort of additional buyer stamp duty as compared to the other foreigner counterpart of any other country outside of the five listed just now. So essentially, that is a 20% off. So that's the end of today's episode. Hope you find this information useful and helpful to you. So if let's say you are either a national or permanent resident of Iceland, Liechtenstein, Norway, Switzerland and the national of United States of America rejoice because you just got a good 20% off of your property in Singapore. This is the end of the episode. Do follow us on all our social media platforms. You can find us at HomequartersSG on Facebook and Instagram. And if you are watching this on YouTube, do hit the like and subscribe button and also the bell that comes after the subscribe button to be notified of the newest video where it comes live. Thank you and see you on the next episode.